In this video, I'm going to talk about some of the ways you can help your child if they uh, suffer separation anxiety when they're starting school and starting prep. Um, separation anxiety is a very normal and natural occurrence for some children, if not most of them on the first day or the first couple of days of school. Children come to school and some can be very see you later mum at the door, I'm fine. Other children can be come in for a little while and then happy for you to go. Other children are like, come in, stay with me, please don't go. They're all very normal responses. We always love parents coming in first thing in the morning and see their children settle in. When it's time for parents to go, some children can become a little bit clingy and they can become teary and that's all very normal responses. Uh, please be reassured that, you know, we will help um, take your child from you, take them by the hand and we take them to an activity that they enjoy doing. And every time, you know, you may leave them and they're a bit teary and that may make you feel a bit upset, but please be reassured those tears are only for about 30 seconds. The children do settle down, their minds taken off um, their separation from you, they're playing with activities, playing with other children, and they settle in wonderfully. If there ever was an occurrence where your child was really upset for a long time, we would notify you, but we've actually never had that occur. The children all always um, settle down and we make them feel nice and comfortable and happy in the classroom. Uh, but a great way is communication. If your child is unsettled about coming to school, um, after those first initial weeks, please let us know and we can be in conversation about how we can help you at home with strategies and what we will do to help alleviate the problem. A child who may have previously had some separation of anxiety and has then settled in really well, occasionally um, situations can change and that anxiety may return. That's not a problem. There may have just been some changes at school, it may have been a little incident that upset them, so communication is a key. Sometimes we find if children um, have their parents that need to go away for work, that can also unsettle them a little bit. So if, if we can know about those incidences, that helps us to give a little bit more extra TLC when they're experiencing those problems at home or at school.